let's take a look at TaylorMade Stealth On. Yeah, this is a uh, traditional, you know, nothing really strange here at all. You know, pretty cool looking from the back, obviously Talo. Um, it's got the cutaway in the bottom, so it's got the double, you know. Yeah, a little speed slot off the bottom. Slot of the bottom. Uh, it's a relatively wide sole, not massive by any means, uh, and relatively flat. Um, yeah. Not a lot of camera in it, which yeah. is interesting. Um, but it's a good golf club all around, right? It's yeah. it's a little bit lower price than some of the other ones in this category, you know, some of the competitors and stuff. So it's... Uh, and there's nothing really bad about it. There's just nothing stand out about it, right? It's right in the middle. It's like, because, well, our intent is to amount of them. They're, they're, it's a good golf club. Yeah, this, this, these whole reviews are like, okay, who, you know, how are we going to help you understand this right. golf club? Who is it going to be for? And it just leaves us with a bit of a tough question. Like, who really is it for? Like, price point is definitely a, is a good thing. Yep. Um, it's got a little bit of distance, 161. Um, stopping power isn't bad for the clubs that are in that uh, zone, right? The, right. Yeah, so decent, right? We've seen that down to three, even uh, you know, which is considerably worse than that. So, yeah, it's, it's reasonable for that, and it's not super long either. I mean, I think this is just a really good golf club for, you know, um, you know, t you know, twelve to eighteen handicap, whatever. That uh, is strong, doesn't need the distance. All right, some of these distance things, when you get a strong younger player or something, yeah. you know, they hit too far. Yeah, um, this is a good club all around for that sort of player. And it doesn't, it doesn't look crazy. It's not a, not a crazy big no, game No, it looks pretty decent, thing. actually. Yeah. You know, um, for a game of Hoofing Club, it's pretty traditional shape. Nothing really goofy going on. Got a little technology in here. They do the fluted hosel thing, um, which is a nightmare for us trying to put a connector into. But uh, other than that, it actually makes a lot of sense, right? So they're taking weight out of an area of the, the club so they can put more mass behind the club. So yeah. that, that actually makes a lot of sense to do. It's just and the tricky for us. the black strip around the hill there is just helping. Yeah, and that's what I'm with here, right? This is designed to help you bend it a little easier, right? Yeah. So it doesn't crack in a, in a bad spot, so. Yeah, and I can say they, they, they're cast, but they don't feel bad. They don't, you know. No, they're they're actually, they're pretty like decent. That. Yeah, yeah they, they got a good feel to them. Yeah, cool. Well, I like this one, you know, it's just kind of right in the middle. So I, I would say probably, you know, you're, you're kind of 12 to 18 handicap. Yeah. Yeah, ballpark. Yeah. Um, Taylor Mind's got a big following. They're a cult following. Yeah, so. and they make great products all around. So yeah, yeah this is a good, this is a good intermediate club. Let's put it that way. Yeah, yeah. thanks, Mark. Thanks.